Directors of a Weston nonprofit foundation whose goal is to help people in Africa return from a two week trip to the country. As Newsline 9's Cami Mountain tells us, one of the biggest projects for Foundation for Hope in Africa is bringing clean water to villages. It's a sign like this beside a man drilling a water well that says it all. In Africa, water is life. Without water, uh, there is this, the idea of sanitation is just completely lost. Uh, because when there's unsafe drinking water, there are outbreaks of cholera and all other kinds of waterborne illnesses. So when people have safe drinking water, then the health of that village actually rises. Dr. Robin Wild is executive director of Foundation for Hope in Africa. He, alongside Corporation President Roger Zipper, traveled to three countries, Uganda, Rwanda, and Ethiopia, talking to the African people about how their projects, like digging wells, are helping. This video of kids at a school in Uganda shows exactly how much it is. It's one of the areas where the kids have to walk three miles to get fresh water. And life is very, very hard for those folks. And um, they, were just, they were just so appreciative that we were there and taking the time to visit with them. And the foundation was funding the, the digging of the well right at the school. But it's not just wells. In another village in Uganda, a reservoir was built and stocked with fish to sell to bring money to the village. At this school, the foundation paid to have the floors and windows redone and the well outside fixed. In less than a year, they've given thousands of African people a foundation for hope. I take away more than we ever are able to give to them because uh, there's just this great sense that uh, we've been able to help these folks get started. We're, we're blessed with so much here in our part of the world. We have so much, um, and, and the folks here are so, so good and so willing to share that with others, and it's great to be a part of that. With the coverage you can count on, Cami Mountain Newsline 9, Weston. Foundation directors are already looking at other projects for next year. One of those is bringing electricity to an orphanage that's without water and power. If you'd like to help, there's a link to their website on WAOW.com.